Well, this is the Hubs and Zeno's last flight. Um, we'll be crashing here in approximately two and a half minutes. <clears throat> but I was uh, enjoying a nice evening last night. That would have been April 28th, 2020. And my neighbor had just walked up and was asking about my drone. And so I decided to show him the sunset and the view of the neighborhood. And <clears throat> we began to talk and I, I was looking at him and then I happened to glance down at the screen here after rotating uh, perspective and then I noticed this shimmy and then the signal disappeared and I couldn't get contact with the drone and so I thought well just wait a second it's going to reestablish I'm not that far away uh, and <clears throat> during this time I can't see the drone or what it's seeing I can't see on my cell phone. And then when the, the drone finally did, you'll notice it's it's moving swiftly east. Um, that main road there runs north and south, so it has moved significantly east. And when I finally get signal, I'm puzzled as to where I am because this is not where I thought I was. I'm not all that far away, but this is not where I expected. So I'm like, okay, I recognize that. <clears throat> And there you can see something's different. There's a blade that's appearing in the screen. And I'm trying to direct it back home. I don't feel like things are right. And so I'm like, okay, now I can see the park, which is right in the, in the view there. <clears throat> and it is wanting to move laterally to the left. Uh, it did that before when it was traveling east. It was, it was yawing heavily when I wasn't touching the, the controls. And so here I'm trying to turn and get it over the park. Um, I'm on the corner house with the pool in the backyard. I, I can see myself in the driveway. I can hear the drone <clears throat> and I can't control it. It's not responding to the controls. Um, it did try to do a return to home and I hit cancel because I thought I could control it. And then this is what happened. This is clearly not a sign of misuse or user error, and there are far too many reports right now in Facebook groups where people are experiencing the same thing. So I sure hope that Gearbest and Hubson can address this issue and remedy the people who are out hundreds of dollars for something that appears to be a far too common problem.